in today's video, I'll be unboxing these Osmo Coding Obby, and I'm so excited, and this is going to be so exciting, so let's see what we have inside. So what this includes is 19 coding blocks right here, Coding Obby game app, of course get this on your device, a stackable storage area, which is right here, and of course what's not included is the Osmo base or the device you're going to have your app on. So here we have grown up instructions, now let's see what's inside. So here we of course have one sticker depending on the app. And let's see what's in the storage area. So let's open this up. And ta-da! And here it is. So how this basically works is that you are going to be functioning these. So every step, for one step, you just move this if you want to go forwards, this way, or this way. Now let's start playing. So what you would need is the Osmo base and the device, which is not included, and of course the fun part, your activity. For instance, the coding obby. So what you're going to do is grab your iPad, and then you're going to put it on, and put the red piece on top so it can detect whatever you're playing with. And remember to download the app to have so much more fun. Now let's start playing. So get your coding obby app. And then it will say Osmo. So Osmo wants to use your camera. Then you just play for continue. So we are gonna access the camera depending on what app you use. So of course I have coding blocks, so yes. So now let's see what it's gonna tell us. It tells you various instructions. So there's the coding obby. Now let's play. And of course I already have my account. There it goes. So let's take the blocks out. So now let's play continue. Hmm. So let's see what's happening. So an asteroid hit a mountain. Then it sneezed. So now it's sick and the house is broken. Let's continue. You're sad. Need wood to get to make the house. But look what happened, the coincidence. So it told me to put the run button right here, like this, and I'm gonna put it at the very edge. Let me see. Now I need to press this, like this. So it played one. Now I'm gonna turn down. Down. And let's play. So we turn out. And then and I put that done. I put this one back and I press play. So now I can move it to this side. I'm gonna press play. And then again. Another way of doing this is maybe putting repeat on it. So I can grab a three, put it here, and then press repeat. Now I have to go forwards. So I can do that. And just to be safe, let's do two. And let's press play. And so we have to keep on going. So now let's put the three here. Okay, to go forwards. Just play. Mm -hmm. So now we're gonna go downwards. Press play. Then let's see. One, two, three, four. So let's grab number four. Exchange this. And then let's move this to the side. Just press play. Now we're going down. So right now we're going down. One, two, three, four. Okay. See how this works. Oh, we're almost there. So we have one, two, three, four. To get to the dog, then it's five. So that was just a practice round so we get to know the app and also so how the functions work. It can glitch a little times, but it usually it's smooth. So now let's get started on the real version. So now we are actually at the steps and levels. So let's press level one. So 
Now let's play. So let's go one. Now we need to skip one. So let's grab our skip. Let's move it this way and put a one at it. So let's do that. Okay. Nope. Now we have to try downwards. Move it there. Right there. So let's go. Again. And again. So let's see. We have to move one that way and skip one. So what we could do is we could do this really simple. We do this, move on this way, which then we have to skip one. Let me get that star. We have to skip one. So let's see how this works out. We did it. Let's try that again. Let's see, one more time. Oh, the strawberry is coming. So let's go that way. Let's take the skip out. Take this one out. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five. So we'll do five of those. And then one turn. And we can go ahead in time to see what we can do. So we can go. Well, that would be too much. So let's just stick with what we have right now. And do one. So let's try this. We have more so we have to do one two three four five then one down there we go one down so we do have to go one down so let's switch this out and then one skip so one skip downwards let's try this We did it. Now let's go ahead. One, two, three. So I'm gonna go three. And let's take the skip away for right now. Let's press play. Okay, so now we have to skip. So let's take the walking part out. Let's see. One, two, three. So if we went like this, skipping, we would go one, two. So we have to do a two skip. Let's try that. We did it, and we got a pie. 50 plus. Now, we could skip, or we could go too, but I would skip just. Oh no, we have to start over now. And then, what we're gonna do, so skip one. Then we have to go down one more. Let's put that there. Then we put this one. Let's try that common. There we go. I think that's going to work. We got one. So here it's telling me my accomplishments. I got 292 over here and then 235 is max. So let's see what's going to happen. So what are we going to unlock? another 200 so now I have 492 so let's see what's happening next so we could do that or we can go back to my house which I think is up oh oh no mountain let's go back here and then I'll show you what we could do there now of course remember there were building. So we could do an egg for 75 to get more strawberries and collect 25. But then I would get another cedar egg to make another one, but it would cost strawberries. 
So here what I can do is collecting wood, I can rebuild something. So I can make this. Because I have three of them. Or I can just take that away. Here I have for a hundred of those. Now some of them do not have choices of wood, but yes I do. And there we go. Let's go back into the map. And I hope you enjoyed this video. Of course we could do much more. So I really like this game and makes your brain work a lot because you have to be precision to get the coding correctly. So remember that this is kind of complex for a reason because it is coding. I get it. Coding can be hard, but it's a simple step of engineering. When you grow up, you can be an engineer. You know that a lot of apps, your TVs, anything you use takes so much precision in coding. That is amazing. Sending a simple text message to your parent, anybody, could be hard too. It's very precise. And this is building you up so you can get more complex coding. And remember, this is for ages 5 to 12. So if you're older, it can still be fun. This will help you in school. If you want more information on this product or any other Augma product, the link will be down below. Give me a thumbs up for this video over and over again. Comment and share. And don't forget to subscribe button down below. Thank you for watching. Bye!